They told me. Son, you're special. You were born to do great things. You know what? They were right. What's up, family? It's your host, uh, Bioshock? Hi. Uh, I'm gonna see if I can beat this game very quickly. Okay. I've been playing this and Bioshock 2 for the past, like, week and a half. I've been trying to just achievement farm, and I got fed up because a lot of the achievements are glitched in this fucking... In this version of the game, like I've 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 beat it twice now on the hardest difficulty without dying, and I haven't gotten the achievements for those particular things. So I'm, I'm mad with the game. I'm mad at 2K. I'm mad at Steam. Uh, so I want to challenge myself. I want to see if I could beat this shit in like an hour or two. I think the world record's like 40 minutes or something. I don't know how that's possible, but I'm just, I'm just gonna try to... I'm just gonna try to zoom. I've never tried to zoom through this game. I've always been meticulous with like picking everything up. So what I'm gonna do is I'm not gonna get any big daddies. I'm not gonna get any little sisters. I'm not gonna get any Adam or anything. No health upgrades. Nothing. Um... I want to see if it's possible. I want to see if I'm good enough. The two puzzles are pretty fun. I am Andrew. Ryan, I like them, but after playing it so many times these past couple of weeks, I'm just like I'm over them. But there are automatic hack no, tools in this game that are pretty easy to craft, so you can bypass those entire no, puzzles. Says the man in the Vatican. It it's pretty good. This is one of my favorite games ever, no, by the way. The man in I love Moscow. this series. It belongs to everyone. The games, all the games have fundamental I flaws, but there's just something so guys. charming about them. Instead, I chose something different. I chose the impossible. Also, I'm gonna try to just do this with pistol, machine gun, and shotgun. But I might accidentally pick something else up, so don't hold me to that. I I forget things very easily. would not be insensitive. Where the scientists would not be bound by petty morality. Where the great would not be constrained by the small. It really sucks that this uh, this version of the game has issues because. It's probably the most stable performing game out of all of them, like out of any version of the game that I've purchased. When I first purchased the game, I had like major issues with saves. Then I got the Steam version, that one had major fucking FPS hiccups. And then this one is so smooth, it's smooth like butter. It's so nice, it loads so quickly, and then the achievements just decide not to work sometimes. It's a shame. There's always there's always something wrong with these games. I'm cursed. I'm cursed. When I first played this, I this is like this was like my introduction to Abraham, and I thought it was such a badass because I was reading fucking Atlas Shrugged. Uh, as a freshman in college, I was like, yeah, I get this because I played Bioshock. I get objectivism. <laughs> Little did everybody know is because of a fucking video game. Like a real cool guy. Everything is influenced by video game.
Let me see if I could just turn this down just a little bit more. The audio in this game is weird as well. Bioshock. I wonder if this game is possible without using any plasmids. I don't think I don't think it is. I think you need to use them with like puzzles. Oh, I'll be tubing, believe me. But I'm gonna be doing it the cheap way. Be getting all those automatic hack tools, baby. I'm a bit of a hacker, guys. I don't know if you guys know this about me. A bit of a hacker. I I dabble in hacks. In a uh, in darknet hacking, a bit of a flumper, if you will. This is the scary part of the game. So you're you're allowed to scream in chat. You're allowed to scream. Scream if you want. Playing Bioshock 2 really fucks with you when you go back to this game too because the controls are so different. This is one of those games that flips. This game has E for use, Bioshock 2 has F for use, and it really fucks with you. There should just be a universal use key that every game is required to use by default. And I know I could just change it, okay? But I'm not gonna do that because I'm a privileged gamer. A privileged genius. I'm sorry if any of you want to see the story of this, sir. We're not, look, we're not waiting for the story. We're just, we're all business. Why is it doing this? Oh, that's right. Get to your ship in this. Leave me alone! Come on! I just want to... Don't panic. I know the photo research system in this is so flawed. It was a little better in Bioshock 2, but it felt like the rewards weren't really worthwhile. Like they they really maximized the damage that you did in this game. But you just spam, you just buy film and you spam the fucking photo key over and over and over again. It's dumb. In the next one, like, you actually have to perform, uh, you have to, like, change up your style of attack to get, like, higher research, uh, for certain things. And it takes a while. But those, that achievement sucks, too. There's only an achievement in, in two for maxing all the research. There's not even, like, an individual one like in this one. Yeah, absolutely. I think the concept could have been fleshed out a little bit more. Looks like he just had his cherry popped. Wonder if he still got some atom. Every Bioshock is just like a collection of very good ideas and very good storylines with something to weigh them down. And I used to be the kind of guy who was just like I would just look past them and I was like, no, these games are great, these games are the best. But playing through them recently, I'm just like these are these games are still very good, but they just have fundamental fucking flaws that cannot be overlooked. Like the the last half of like the third act of this game is such a fucking slog. It is not fun. It's fun the first time you play it because of the story elements and like the reveals, but then you're just like I just want this to be over now. And the boss sucks too. Boss fights in these games suck so bad. Wait a minute. So yeah, evil. yeah, they 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 get super right. spongy unless you research them, an and then it just feels like it, it makes no sense because like I maxed out all the research about halfway through uh, the last time I played this, and then I'm in the later levels and some of the splicers die so quick, others don't, and it it makes no fucking sense why some of them are stronger than others because they're all max research, it makes no fucking sense. 
It's just artificial difficulty. Also, I'm gonna be, I'm gonna be reading about this in this whole stream. I apologize if that's not what you want to see. Uh, but I'm a gamer. I think the best thing about Bioshock 2, playing through it again, is the fact that you could dual wield. That is the best fucking idea. I wish they had it in this game. Because going back to this is so inferior. Upstairs. <laughs> he might double back though. Uno. I can control myself. I can. I love turrets. <laughs> turrets just fucking. They're just hit scanners. It's bullshit. Sometimes you're like your foot is poking out and you get hit by a turret. It's pretty good, man. If only they had combined the best elements from this and Bioshock 2, I think they would have a solid, like, a solid experience throughout the entire game. Because I think this, this game has more levels, but there's just, there's so many levels that are forgettable, especially towards the end, because they're just super short, and they're just fetch quests. And then the second game, they have fetch quests, but they're, they're a lot stronger. The levels are a lot longer, so you feel a little bit more connected to them. And the the mechanics are a lot more fun as far as, like, as the weapon variety and the fact that plasmids, like when you upgrade them, they actually have like secondary functions. It's good stuff. Dude, the security bots are such a detriment, too. I like them in the second game a little bit more because they're more useful, but my god, they always get in your fucking way when you're shooting grenades in this game. It's ridiculous. They just get hit by everything. Like, every time I use a plasmid, a fucking security bot gets in my way and absorbs the hit and gets disabled. Every time. Guys, I'm gonna spoil it for you. There's a big daddy up there. There's a dad up there. Open the door! I gotta complete the level. Also, where did he go? Did he open the door? Where did he go? He's gone. Where did he go? I just stun her. I mean, they could follow me. I've never tested this, by the way. So I won't even know if this will work, probably. Let's see. Is he just stuck up there? <laughs> Is he just gonna stay there forever now? There's a glitch that happens with this a lot too, where you stun them in the water, which is supposed to instantly kill them, and uh, they they get stuck in an animation in the water. 
He might still be alive. No, he's dead. Okay, here we go. I've had it happen every time I play this level. Why is this guy not aggroed on me? What the fuck is this game? This game is so, this game is so glitched. Why are they not aggroing? Get the fuck down here! You're gonna ruin my playthrough. My golden playthrough. I think they broke. This is what I mean. Like, this game is... This this version is so good, but so bad at the same time. Hold on, I'm gonna rebind something real quick because I'm, I'm used to it more in Bioshock 2. Where's the fucking heal key? First aid, there we go. Save that shit. Okay, now they're coming down. Now they've decided it's time to go. I'm gonna try to do this with my bomb. Don't don't hold me to that either. Wait a second, this this isn't supposed to trigger until you get through the door. I don't think wait, maybe not. I don't know. I might be wrong. No no, it was supposed to trigger. But it was a little I think it was a little early still. That was a very unfortunate start. Thank you so much for the 21 months. I'm sorry, I don't have uh, alerts on because I had them in another scene. Thank you for the watch. I will need it. Open! Open! Should I, should I research splicers for a bonus? Or would that be considered? Do you think that would, that would be considered cheating? I mean, I'm setting these rules, so I guess I can make it whatever I want. <laughs> Here's the most fun game in the fucking entire franchise. Actually, I, I shouldn't be shit talking this. I, I enjoyed this when I first played it. This particular thing. I thought it was an interesting little hack. To it. I think it's better in the second game though, because it's so quick. It's quick and it makes you pay attention more. Bioshock. No memeing tonight. I'm just gonna try to meme through this game. It's also the best gun in the game. It's very reliable. What the- Where the fuck did she come from? What the fuck? 
Who am I cheating here right now? Drop the pistol, but it's too late for that. No looking back. Ever. Oh shit, I might not have enough. Oops. I might not have enough to deal with these drones. You keep an eye peeled for Stoyman. The dark bastard set up shop in the surgery wing. You want to find them? Just follow the blood. Looking the wrong way. <laughs> Ten bucks. Fuck it. Was she healing from this fucking distance? Are you kidding me, man? Let me show you a little hack here. There's traditional hacking, and then there's brute forcing, okay? Any hacker can tell you about this. You just hit the thing until you get a med kit, okay? This is a legitimate strategy that real hackers use. You hit the thing until it works, okay? Let me teach you about it. Here. Oh, I know, the hacking always takes time. But once we get the auto hack, it's, it's gonna be fine. And then I'll just start wasting turrets. I, I don't even care. Turrets are, turrets are usually uh, more harm than good in this game, anyway. It's all good. Yes, I absolutely forgot about telekinesis. Absolutely. fucking lootly uh, Telekinesis I've never used. There's like... There's like a fully upgradable... This is the wrong way. A fully upgradable version of it um, in Bioshock 2 that like allows you to throw bodies even though you can do that already. In, in this game, it makes no sense, and it's so useless. In this game, it's so glitched, you could usually one-shot it. This is also the wrong way. Hold on, I'm getting all turned around here. Wait, am I going to be lost? No, this is the wrong way. He does this, we trigger that. We gotta get the telekinesis. Hypo, thank you for the 20 months. I also have the Big Bioshock over here. Off like it's the of July. This is the way we have to go. This guy's gonna be annoying. Actually, I could probably bypass this guy. Right right this guy would just get incinerate and run around. Security cameras. <laughs> 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 Oh, you could grab live enemies? I didn't know that. Okay, okay, that's worth it. That's pretty good. I, I still won't use telekinesis, but that is way better than what I expected. Way better. Yeah, it's it's at like Fontaine Futuristics that you get it, so you're, you're pretty much at the end. I'm not sure why they structured 
Uh, is this now in my fucking way? Like, what am I saying? Okay, never mind. We're good. I don't know why they structured the acquisition of plasma in that game. It's really stupid. Oh, you fuck! I did like the story in Infinite. Infinite's probably my favorite one. It might be nostalgia. I'm, I'm actually gonna play through it again soon. I'll, I'll get back to your to that call in one second. Oh. I really liked what they did with the story in Infinite when I first played it. I have very fond memories of that game. That game really hit me hard. Uh, it, it might be nostalgia though. I'm not. I'm not entirely sure if I trust my uh, my recollection of that game. I'm gonna play it again. I'm actually. I'm actually in the midst of downloading it. I'll probably download it after uh, I end the stream. I'm gonna play through it like, the next couple of days just to, just to see if it holds up in my memory. But I remember the, the enemies in that game are fucking terrible. Like, they're absolutely the worst that they could be. This is where it's out. See, I forget, because I've been playing too. And now I gotta keep this piece of shit. You don't like it for that? What did you not like about it? Was it, was it because the story was so far-fetched? Or was it the combat? Because the combat in, this, in that game is very bad. I can't, I can't defend it. It's, it's fun to use plasmids in that game. I, I'd say like mid game is probably its strongest because you're actually as strong as the enemies that you're fighting. Um, but the beginning is definitely a slog because of how, especially on higher difficulties, how. Uh, overpowered the enemy's feel. This guy's still following. Me. Oh. Live, man. Live and let live, I say. Kiloton Kraken, thank you so much for that six months. Bless you. You preferred one and two. Yeah, like I said, like I, I don't. That might change. That, that might change once I revisit it. But I, I had a lot of fun revisiting one and two. But uh, it definitely, my memories of it were soured a little bit because because I've gotten older and because I've played so many different things. I just, I guess, I just notice the prevalence of the mistakes in that game. Like some of the mechanics that didn't work. Ten bucks, whatever. Do it. Is this static? Uh. Yeah, let's see what we're not. Oh, I'll change this. I don't really like that one. We need this guy. This guy's useful. Fucking goddamn, how many alarms are in here? Jesus Christ. Uh, there we go. You're trying to rush. It's scary. Here we go. Definitely need this. Oh my god, I have like no evil clothes. I need that. Thought box, thank you for the 17 months. Bless you. All the figures function the same? Um, I can... 
kind of agree with that, but I forget which one, uh, which one it is, what it's called, because it's been so long, but the one that you get that absorbs bullets and tosses them back as grenades was so much fun to use for me. That and the horse one. That, that, sound, that sounds like, like an old man describing a video game. The, I like the horse one, but I don't remember what they were called. It's been so long. Yeah, the, the enemies are definitely forgettable too. There's a few of them that are kind of kind of cool, like the handyman. But that's I think that's mostly because I'm nostalgic for the for the big daddy. Can you fucking attack this guy? Oh, there we go. Because he's gonna divert all the attention on his enemies. Oh, that's what he's Why he's so focused on this bot because he wasn't original. He really wants to kill this bot. I don't think he even goes to the He fucking wants to kill this droid so bad. We got him. There's so many health kits in this part. I'm just gonna get this one real quick. Oh, you used TK on him? Really? I never thought to do that. I guess it's because I never use TK, like I always forget TK is a thing. So it just, just through instinct, I forgot about it. I forgot I even had it in my inventory. I, I, I thought I still had incinerate. I wish you got electric flesh really early on in this. It would make life so much easier, just avoiding all your own electric attacks. Oh, that's a good idea. I never thought of doing that. I, I always just attacked him with, uh, with a machine gun. When he worked in the last game, like, in the previous version of this game, where you actually have to fight him, you, you would just attack him with anti-personnel and ammo. Why do they not model any of the main characters besides Andrew Ryan in this game? That still confounds me. They just reused fucking splicers for all of them. I, I, like, why do they do that? They did it for the second. Well, I guess they had more of a budget with the second one, but they should have modeled all the main characters if you're gonna show them. <laughs> they put Tenenbaum in like this room later, behind glass, and put her in the shadows. Like you're not gonna notice that she looks exactly like a splicer. <laughs> the same thing with with uh, Atlas. His face is even missing. Like he, he he's. He's all fucked up like a regular slicer. All right, let's let's rescue her. No, you know what? We gotta harvest her, guys. Sorry. We gotta eat her. Eat the child. That's true. That is true. They made plasmic combinations so viable in two, especially like with the fact that you could combine uh, traps with plasmids. That was such a good idea. And it's Dr. Tenenbaum that got the thanks for it. Yeah, in the second... Or in uh, in Infinite, yeah. The, the lack of weapons, like... The, the weapons never felt good in that game, either. It just felt like a typical shooter. It was a bummer. You know what? That's a, that's a pretty good point. Maybe they did think their lighting was exceptional. No plasmids. 
None. Let me go, Atlas. Do I have to spin Adam? Alright, I have to spin Adam. I'm sorry. Uh, what's more useful? No, fuck it. I'll make an exception this once. These two. And that's it. I never knew you had to spend it. I had no idea. We're out of here. We're getting the fuck out of here. I like 2 a lot. Uh, I, ha I definitely have problems with it now, playing through it again. But it is... I think it's like Bioshock fully realized. They, sh they should have made one more like 2. There's a lot of mechanics in 2 that would have worked really well if they had if uh, if 2 had as strong a story as this game. Let's get the fuck out of here. Neptune time. I wonder how I'm gonna fight Atlas with just a pistol, a machine gun, and a shotgun. We'll figure that out once we get there. And no plasmids too. Only incinerate and fucking uh, electrobolt. That's gonna be interesting. I'm also striving to try to do this without any doubt. I don't. I don't see that happening. I don't know. Maybe you know what? I don't really like incinerate. Maybe I should start using telekinesis a little bit. I don't really use incinerate that much. Let's we'll go all hypos. All hypothermics. I like the story the first time I played it. Um, I definitely notice its flaws a lot more now since I played it so many times. I guess it's just like when you. When you make a sequel to a game that's as iconic as Bioshock, that has such a major twist as Bioshock, like, the, I did not see the twist in this game coming at all. And I, I'm not gonna spoil it or anything. You'll probably miss it, though, because I'm just gonna zoom through everything. But I really like the twist in this. I don't know if it was obvious to people. It was not obvious to me. So I really enjoyed it. I thought it was pretty cool. Um, but going off a game like that with such... I can't, this, is this passable? Oh, it is passable. Uh, going off a game like that with such a major, major plot twist, uh, people are just going to expect it in the second one. So I guess that's why it kind of seems more lackluster to me. Maybe I was expecting the same thing. But the mechanics are solid. The mechanics are, are more fun than this game in the second one. And I also like how... How they changed the uh, enemy variety in the second one. They they made them look a lot better. Atlas, ready, hold on ahead. I'm not gonna use that grenade launcher. For an invite to the yeah, yeah, I not completely agree. I say, but if in your heads up to the war, it did pretty well. I, I think it did pretty well. I was super hyped for it. I beat it in two days, and the only reason it took me that long is because I my eyes started hurting from sitting in front of the computer for so long. My friend, you are. Exactly. We got known for the twist more so than anything else. I'd rather not lose them, but whatever. I have to just wait her out. Oh, there we go. I'm going to get out of here. I think it's too soon. I'll still have a soft spot in my heart for this game. I can't help it. Even with its flaws, I love it. I'm like a, I'm like a mother. 
I'm gonna try to avoid as much as I can. I'm gonna try to just do it with these three weapons. Let me out! Just remember, sunny friend. I smell an ounce of Fontaine on you, and I'll have you in a box. Atlas gives you the vouch. I turn in my eye just on his say so. Oh shit. I guess it's heat seeking, isn't it? Because you get heat seeking uh, missiles from it. it. Sucked the heat out of me. I noticed I was in heat. There we go. so quick. Alright. Okay. I've never done this in one sitting. Oh, you know what? It was probably the, the one that launches missiles right now. Uh, probably just combined damage. That's probably what, that's probably what it was. Is that a drum? That yeah, drum, baby. Jesus loves me this art and no I got like nothing. This is what happens when you don't you don't fight anybody. Come on. You monster. I took her picture. It's fine. Now we're out of here. I <laughs> know. I did on the Xbox 360 version. I remember my my brother was uh, 
was really into gamer score and he was like can you because he knew i played the game so he's like do you think that you could just do this for me so i could get the uh thousand gamer score and i said yeah and i did it in one second that's how well i know the game okay. well back in the day now uh, not as good definitely not as good at the game mode in this game actually isn't that bad if you play it legit it's totally doable you could just juke the the big daddies i don't know if they changed the way they behave in the remastered version but they, they made it so fucking easy to beat the first two bouncers in the first uh, in the medical pool uh, no i'm sorry the first bouncer in the medical pavilion you could just jump up and down off a fucking table and he just keeps looping around and you just keep feeding him hits. And then if you, uh, if you research them all the way, you could just... You could, you could pretty much just juke them every fucking time you play. It's a very easy I'll we'll take it, whatever. We can't very well take your plasma away now, can he? Um, God, what was I saying? I'm just gonna keep forgetting what I'm saying. You know what? I'm gonna keep the fight. Oh, no, I could change. I could swap this out afterwards. It's fine. I'll just use the tele to telekinesis for now. Take my weapons, baby. It gets cold, bar. It get cold as fuck. This is the cold level. My God. It's good that he's still speaking while I'm doing this. He's giving me the time. I think that's what also improved the gameplay in the second one. Like, the fact that you had to hack and fight at the same time. You had to just multitask. You didn't just get, like, some save screen. Some safe screen, I should say. So he's gonna have a turret in a second. A turret. <laughs> that is the best way to play it. I completely agree with you. I wonder if there's any Bioshock role-playing communities who just play the game with a role-play as the main character. I guess you would earn them though. So do that. No, yeah, I guess you can do that. That's interesting. I know the hack the hacking game in the second one is great. Back first. Pro tip. Spare. 
air ammunition here. That is money. You I'm not doing it with this. Oh fuck! Oh fuck! Oh no, you played all of Far Cry New Dawn? I'm so sorry. Or actually, you might have enjoyed it. Did you enjoy it? Did you like it? That game is is probably my most disappointing experience of uh, 2019 so far. And that's saying a lot considering all the bad games I play. That game made me so fucking mad. I bought that after a long day at work. I was looking forward to playing it. And it made me so mad that I had to stream it. I had to stream it and share my anger with everybody. Oh, you didn't? Okay. <laughs> I didn't want to, you know, I didn't want to assume. How did that not hit him? How did that not hit him? You know, the easiest way to do this would be to just research these bots. I could do that, actually. I, sh I should start doing that. Because then you could just automatically hack them once you get to level 2 research. That would save a lot of time. I could just hit them and hack them. That's my strat, baby. Hit them and hack them. I would probably feel the same way as you did, Hypo. I heard everybody hyping that game. And I just didn't see it. Like, three, three pretty much killed that franchise for me because it just was so repetitive, and it was. I don't know. It it it, it just annoyed me. That that game annoyed me. Far Cry Two is probably the best Far Cry. I still stand by that. So much fun. Far Cry New Yawn should have been the title. You get playing it, hoping the story would improve. I lost all hope as soon as I saw the two antagonists. I'm just like, they're just doing Far Cry 3 antagonists two times. And that's it. You just drop me in the fucking wilderness with a compass and a map and have me buy weapons like I did in, in 2 and I'll have a good time. Yeah, they, they definitely got a system that worked, and they just kept repeating it over and over. Which is really, you know, that's how you make a good game. Just r rinse and repeat. It worked for Assassin's Creed, right? I know. I feel, I feel terrible that I've missed out on those things, honestly. They're monuments to the gaming industry. Arcadia and Port Crawler are my favorite levels in this franchise. Welcome, Martin Lawrence. There's two ways to deal with a mystery. How are you? Uncover it or eliminate it. Is Fallout 76 free to play yet? <laughs> Because if it is, I'll check it out. <laughs> Just to see how bad it is. Just to see, um, you know, the pinnacle of gaming. I tried so hard, Hypo, to play Metro. I played the first one about halfway and then I played the second one a little bit and I just could not get into them and I, I don't understand why. I think maybe they just came at the wrong time in my life. I think if I had played them around the same time I played Bioshock or Stalker, I would have liked them. I couldn't get into them, and I, I really wish I could, because they, they totally seem like something that would be up my alley. I came to this place to build the impossible. 
You came to rob what you could never build. A hub gaping at the gates of Rome. Even the air you breathe sponged from my account. Well, why am I picking up audio Later, you might remember the case. <laughs> you get to the bathosphere in the Roland Hills. That'll take you straight to the devil himself. Oh, then, all over here. debts will be paid in full. This is the level that I'll start getting confused. Because things look very similar. It's like kind of loopy. Hey, over here! Like before they even um, materialize, they they will hit you twice, and I don't know if that's just this version because it's glitched, or if this was a a thing that was prevalent in the original. I just don't remember. But it's really fucking annoying. I'm the headshot, baby. gonna save my life. Kill her! It's gonna save my entire life. I shouldn't be doing this. I really shouldn't be hacking. It's just it's just a waste of time. It really it really is. Whoever mentioned that earlier, it is a fucking waste of my time. Jockey plasma or the the gene tonic. So I think you get it pretty early on. I think we'll have the amount of damage I have to do with this fucking thing. Never have to research another one again. I I just have to. I just instantly hack. It'll be so much easier. Improve my life. Oh no 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 no! Oh fuck! That's why I hate electric discharge. That's why I hate it. It just 
triggers big daddies. Bypass them. Whoa! Just in case he comes over here. He, he might come over here. Great. It really can, even if you use the hypnotized plasma on a big daddy. Maybe I should invest in getting the chameleon gene tonic so I can turn invisible. Exodus, though, I Did you pass it yet? I, I've seen some of your screenshots. Which makes me wish that I could enjoy the game. That I liked the franchise. Let me just get the game and pause it. Oh, my God! What is this guy doing? Get the fuck out of my way! Over here right now, but it did not help me with that big daddy. Oh boy. Oh, it killed the big daddy! Hell yeah! I've got money now. This this stupid little fucking bot got him. I need that Fujini. Or actually, I can probably do it without him. It's not a big deal. He is a poison. Kill him. It's the not a big deal. I do need this though. Fuck, I, I, I do need to get film because I need to research these stupid turrets. <laughs> so it doesn't take fucking hours. Well, it doesn't even take that long, but you know what I mean. To save time. This is a speed run. first two had. Isn't that always the problem? I totally know what you mean. It's like you're you're always chasing that same feeling that you had when it's a franchise that you love. And it's not always there. And I can never tell if it's me or if it's the game. That's always my issue. Where is there a fucking vending machine right here? I need vending machine. So 
much money. I need to spend. Come on! Great! Almost down here. No, I don't need that. Is there one here? Where is there? Where, where is vending? We've got to have standards, even in troubled times. That thing glitched? Did I just wait a second? Did that big daddy just have more stuff? And I, and I already looted him? I'm not gonna complain. I'll take it. I'll take it, babe. Go back and get my get my I can't get it here. Alright. Oh whoops. I <laughs> just wasted more. You brought the Rosa Gallica? What are you waiting for? An engraved invitation? Send it through the new mode. Yes. Were you annoyed with the fact that they switched platforms last Come minute, or that not bother you? I'm letting you in now. Because I know that affected a lot of uh, a lot of people's opinions on the game. I've got the security system in this joint. Let me just move this so place so cool. Come on, control. No! I don't want to pay for heals! No! No! Break! Break! People who actually speed speedrun this game, if they ever watch me do this, they're probably just fucking pulling their hair out. I'm making all the mistakes. I'd like to genuinely speedrun this sometime, but I'm gonna avoid the chemical thrower as well. I'm gonna try to just keep it to these three weapons. Julie, we made a business deal, you and I, did we not? Money changed hands. Let me read to you from the agreement. Section 3, subsection 4. Mr. Ryan. Ryan Industries maintains exclusive rights to the creation, use, and exploitation of the Lazarus. Ownership is civilization. Have they always done it? Really? Yeah, I don't know. I definitely think it was a shitty move though. Just like without without any warning to do that to people who purchased your game. Or who were thinking about purchasing it. And the funniest thing is, like, I saw so many, uh, it, Hunter, five, seven? I saw so many developers, like, defending their actions, and I just, I don't understand how you could. I just need a bud of Rosa Gallica to confirm my analysis. Distilled water, a bit of chlorophyll, and enzymes extracted from Apis mellifera. That's right, sweetheart. I need to make We're gonna just do it that way for now. We're just gonna do it that way. But yeah, I saw so many people defending their actions, but I just didn't understand how you could. I mean, I, I understand this mentality that some devs have. They're like, we have to stick together. Because who else will? We have to defend our own. But when it's some shady shit like that, when people have already purchased your game, and you're, you're, you're now forcing them to install another fucking launcher, which is what everybody wants, clearly. As many platforms to launch your game from as possible. This thing is fucking broken. Oh shit, I'm shot out of Daddy, get out of the way. Dad, out of the way. Come on, Dad. Oh, is that why they moved? I guess that makes sense. I've heard Steam is very, um, very expensive. Very expensive to put games on Steam. 
I can understand that. Welcome to the circus of value. No, Eve. For Eve. She appeared in it before I left. I guess that's true, Viridium. It, it's different from a dev's perspective, for sure. I'm just the I'm just the fucking consumer who gets annoyed that I have to have multiple launchers. And I don't have a horse in this race anyway because I didn't, you know, I didn't buy the game and I'm not interested in that series. Why the fuck? Why are you now appearing? And now you wasted my plasmids. You wasted my plasmids. I need to... Take care of the bees after... Oh wait, there was a bee pipe over here. Fuck, and I missed it! Even at the bottom of this fish tank, the man must have stumbled. The pathogenic trudeau done at Morley Winery has started putting water to his terrible wife. Water! When I confront him with this party, he tells me, Pierre, this is not to worry. The water, she is still gross. I could take it right from the ocean. Here we go. Why do they wear those masks? Maybe there's a pair of the remember well, they used to be. Oh my god, hack, hack only! And they're ashamed. Hack only! Why is there no film? No one has film! I need film! I got one film. Waste the time, man. We gotta rush here. We gotta rush through this. That's what the people want. That's a rush. A real Let me see. I think this is me. So let me just do this real quick. If I ever attempt this again, I'm never hacking again. No hacking. I'll research everybody so everything's instant. Wait a second, why am I going this way? Isn't there a way to... Hold on a second. Cheese this so many times. Am I going the wrong way? I should remember this. Oh no, I'm supposed to go this way. And then I jump through it. That's what this is, okay. I still have all the shit charge, I just realized. Love money. 
like a hundred in case I need it. Isn't it? It's so much harder. Because the game is too easy. Like I I'm not I'm not trying to be like you know, I'm not trying to be a know-it-all asshole. It's legitimately too easy if you play it the traditional way. Even on the hardest difficulty. Just, it might be because I've played it so often. It is just too fucking easy. It's it's a joke. Especially if you get all the upgrades. Once you get all the health upgrades, you get like everything that's possibly useful. There's, there's no reason to play it that way anymore. There's no challenge. I mean, it's cool if you want an easy game, but it's not a real game. We got everything now. We're good to go. We're good to go. Open, 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 open! Open! Open door! I didn't- I didn't hit this! Alright, we hit it, so it's too late. Big mistake. Do they have film? Welcome no film! No film! <laughs> You're missing the big storylines, guys. I'm so sorry. This really is the fuck it strat. It's fun to even play like not rushing through it and just trying. Like I, I just like challenging myself in this game because I played it so many times. Oh, I just, you just broke. This <laughs> been broke. Uh, it's it's even fun to play if you're not fucking get out of my way. Please. Even if you're not rushing, it's it's fun to play it this way. If you're just uh. Challenging yourself to play it with, um, with uh, as little weaponry as possible and no plasmids or little to no plasmids. Because this game is—I don't think it's passable without plasmids entirely. Oh, here we go. This is what I, need. I thought I hacked that guy. That guy was hacked. You shall know I am the Lord! Up here, here with me. Heck yeah. Doomstrap for sure. I'm dooming. I'm a doomer, guys. Oh, wrench only? That's fucking hard, too. I've never done that. I've never done that because uh, I <laughs> I get the freezing wrench perk, so it's just it's just a nightmare because you just break every enemy and then you can't get loot from them. It's not the greatest strategy, not for me anyway. Right, this is the most annoying part because because it just takes so fucking long. It takes so long to do this. Stuff always slows things down. The boss always makes sure that these things are good. They, they shoot three. Like, why, why would you shoot three? It makes no sense. It makes no sense. A Discord? Yeah, shoot me a message. I'll send you, I'll send you an invite. Just whisper me on here. Otherwise, I'll forget this energy. I have a bad memory. I'm a bad remember. I'll send you a game room. Official game room. Still not there yet, you fucking kidding? I gotta get like a few more things. I think I think maybe one or two. 
should do it. It should give me the auto after that. I just, I just don't want to hack anymore. This is very against my principles, by the way. I'm, I'm such... I'm so stingy about getting the best prices in this game. This is very, uh... This has been a therapeutic thing for me. But let me get rid of static discharge before I get fucking annihilated. Put that there. I don't even care what you put there. It doesn't matter. <laughs> as long as it's not that, I'm good. They need a new Bioshock. A Bioshock type. Wait, what? Oh shit, I need more chlorophyll solution. Okay, I gotta look around here. Damn. I thought I had everything. What a fool. I think I, if I go in that one cave that I avoided... Get the Houdini slice, I should be able to get that really quickly. Guys, this is an embarrassing gamer moment. Put the, put this on live stream fails, guys. I forgot the chlorophyll solution. I was I was zooming through everything so quick, lightning fast, like Sonic the Hedgehog himself. And I forgot an integral part of the game. I don't think there's one in here. I'm pretty sure there's one or two in the other one. And you get them from Houdini's too. I'm a gaming genius, guys. Okay. There should be there should be one or two in here. I only need two. Oh, oh, okay, we only need one. This this will do it. There, there's absolutely one. In here. Yep, there it is. Bye bye. Here we go. Do you have all the components for the Lazarus Spectre yet? I should have guessed because he didn't prompt me with this. He didn't prompt me with. Do you have everything? Oh, the creaking sound? You do <laughs> I was telling my girl about this the other day, but that I have a story about that creaking sound. My brother said that that creaking sound makes him sad when he was younger. He was like 10 years old, and he said it made him sad. <laughs> he was always upset by the creaking sound during the hacking. And he made it known. Oh wait, I don't know. Yeah. Here we go. From the sounds of that you invent, I'm guessing you're the proud papa of a brand new Lazarus Vector. Now drop the vector into a gun. Watch this speedrunner frick everything up. What an idiot! Look at all this time he wasted. She just phased through the entire fucking thing. Oh fuck, I gotta avoid them too. I know, it's the worst part to put one. You just, you run into so many splicers, it's so easy to hit him with just ricochet. So fucking annoying. So used to putting in, um, what are they called? Those mines, but we're doing this the hard way, everybody. Where's the rest of them? Aren't there supposed to be three of them? Sometimes. 
I love when they just spawn in dead. Telekinesis. And he just blew up my shit. Cause they got pissed. I can't use what I want to use because I'm afraid of splashing. Right, that's that's only a third of the entire fucking thing, by the way. Just a third. Just the third. My favorite. Yeah, you can use the over hit the side. I I usually avoid it though because I just I somehow end up hurting it and then he adds it. Really, it, it's more. It does more harm than good. It's like this the static. Just... It's fun in the base game, like if you're if you're not trying to do anything special. Where did this guy just appear? loud for you guys, but I should have asked this earlier. I hope, I hope it's not too loud. Oh my god, he's got another little sister! Fuck off! Oh my god! The game is a little loud compared to my voice. I apologize. Okay. Is this a little better? A little more even? Now we can get the fuck out of here. Now all is well. Now we go to the most fun level in the entire game. I even say fuck it to the audio. Why are you so resistant to the traditional methods of separating a man from his soul? I'm just trying to You're scrounge up anything for this part. This part actually might be easier than this one. I can't seem to Guys, I seem to have forgotten the little sisters in this one. Damn it. Does he get mad when it wears out? You mean the, the Big Daddy? No, I don't think he does. I think he just returns to normal. But he'll get mad if you static discharge... This sounds like I'm just saying that you're coming on the Big Daddy. If you static discharge on him, he gets aggroed. 
and it's very easy to hit him with, with bullets too. Like he just gets in your way. Is amazing, I, agree. I love this level. I should have the chameleon plasma right now. Or the gene tonic. It would be very helpful right now. Oh shit, I've got full hypos, I didn't even realize. Okay, let's do this. You think this is the, the worst part of the game? How do you think that? This is probably where the entire game, like the writing shines the most. And the character development. This was the best part, okay? You're wrong. You're wrong! I'm shaking my fists at you. Sandra Cohen's the best Atlas character in this. Ryan. Da, 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 da. Time wise, you could get something decent on the radio. The artist. In a way, it kind of sucks that this is this is like the halfway point of the game. The because if this was towards so the end, to it would have worked so much better. And hello to an evening with Sander Cohen. Never no. disagree with a game, especially a, a gamer that's a marine. Down here in months. Let's see. Ask Viridian, he'll tell you. Johnny come lately. Oh. Semper Fidelis Something gamers. If anyone gets this reference, I'll mod you. you Do no not look it up. Where are my health kits from the spider splicers? That trick shot. You see that shit? Not any gamer can do that. It's true, you do have to serve to truly no gaming. I've waited so long for something tasty to come to this little burg, but all that Yeah, I absolutely love that part. Where are my manners? Come in, come in. And the music in this game really sells it too. Like th this this game it may sound really, really corny, but this game opened me up to um to jazz and swing music. Like, I had no interest in it until I played this game. It opened my eyes. It made me a better man. That's the wrong one. I always get confused. No need to thank me for jamming the transmissions of those boors, Atlas and Ryan. <laughs> Let them have their Racist vending machines. Yes, What's racist about a damn clown? There is richer to till. For example, I test you, little mom. But for a reason. I test all my disciples. Do you this now? Some shine like galaxies, and some. Absolutely, some absolutely. I think this soundtrack is stronger than Fallout for sure. Come it's the diversity of it. My home. I swear to God, I'm gonna eat this cat a lot. I'm gonna cook him. I'm gonna, I'm gonna chew him up. I'm gonna eat him. Yuki, come in and shush, uh, gamer over here, Yuki. Gaming dad over here, okay? Oh, the Mexican guy. Yeah, that's true. No, no, no. I just automatically default to the Circus of Value. No, that is a that is a very flattering portrayal of uh, a Mexican bandito, if I do say so myself. Very nice portrayal. Very, very.
come down now to more life, death. The burden of the artist is to capture. And now you've got Fitzpatrick caught in his moment of glory. It seems you yeah, that's true. It's it's a one-off in this game. It doesn't overstay its welcome. Cohen, stop talking and let me place it. I've listened, to, I've listened to it so many times, I just kind of turn it off at this point. Although I haven't played Fallout 3 in a while. Do you see it? Because it doesn't work on Windows 10. Or there's like a giant workaround that you have to, to jump through hoops for, so I just play New Vegas. Oh, the picture taking? But there's so much more! The quest doesn't matter. All right, first person to say yes or no is who I'll listen to. Should I take this weapon? It's not OP. It's just another weapon. This is just the moment of conception. Out in this place, there are three men. No, fuck it. Okay. All connected by a common thread. Oh shit! I have to get the incinerate for this. Go! Shall go to you and to Oh no, traps only. Fuck it. I wouldn't have used the traps. I would have just used the the primary function. But I got you. Legit Yemus. If the old grape finally sent someone. Son of a bitch. Left me to free. Fun, uh, shoot me a whisper. I will direct you in the uh, to a man's channel who describes exactly what traps are in a very respectful and informed manner. Via Urban Dictionary. <laughs> oh, did he just? Take a photo of him. Did he just kill himself? I don't know. I don't know how that happened. I didn't do that. Like an expectant mama. Yes. Now put the picture in the frame. Let's see what we've got here. I'm so low on ammo, guys. This is this is rough. This is very rough. Let's see what blew me away when I was younger when I first played this. This. The fact that the smoke leaks through. But then I realized it's just the heat from the gun. And my immersion was ruined forever. Should I hack? Do I have an Oh my god, give me more money! I need more money! Fucking way. I gotta use everything. 
doesn't even get stunned either. Oh god, I forgot about these guys. Look how far this motherfucker runs. This is insane. Well, you know what? Why am I doing it this way? Oh fuck, I don't have I don't have uh telekinesis. That's what I need right now. That's how I should be doing this. But like a true cool, like a true first time gamist. I'm doing it wrong. What? Has she been following me this whole time? A big daddy better not be aggro on me right now. I'll be very mad. Come on, throw it, throw it, throw it, throw it! Throw it, pussy! Come on! Throw it! Oh my lord. This guy does not die. And I've got a spider splicer behind me. And there's... Oh, God. Oh, my fuck. Okay, hold on. I, got, I gotta do this first. Hopefully this ends the research, okay? And the research! Oh my god. I'm so low on ammo. Alright, this is gonna definitely take off time uh, on speedrun. They are! They take so fucking long to kill. And they also take the longest time to research because there's not enough of them for you to get the maximum damage output bonus. Come on, throw the fucking thing, man! Nobody has ever done a speedrun of this game using the strategy that I'm using with no fucking, like, barely any weaponry. <laughs> it makes it so hard. Oh. I don't have anything I can make either to make this easier. Wait, I just picked up... Am I crazy or did I just pick up... I absolutely just picked up uh, machine gun ammo and it disappeared. You cannot be fucking. He just healed himself. This motherfucker, man. He just healed himself for everything I took off. Also not damaging him. <laughs> what the fuck is this game right now? This is why Bioshock is a good game. What? Oh Nothing else. I should have taken the crossbow while I had the chance. He's even given up. <laughs> this 
game is so good, man. My favorite game. Dude, the wrench is worthless if you don't get that wrench jockey perk. It is such shit. It is garbage. And now I lose money. I lose money now. I think? Maybe not. Oh, Lord, I have nothing. I literally have nothing. How much money do I have? 28 bucks. 28 bucks to beat him with. Oh my fuck. And I don't even have... Oh my God. Okay, I gotta do some... I gotta do some damage control here. He's still activated, and he'll be at full health again. I can almost guarantee that. This was a bad idea for a playthrough. Oh no. Come on, maybe. I can attack him. There you go. Kill, kill them! Kill them! Kill them so I can take their ammo. Or I can take your money. One or the other. I'll take either one. You better not still be here. Oh, you don't lose anything. Maybe that's the second game. I thought that the... Oh, he's still here. <laughs> oh my lord. This fucking game, man. You gotta be shitting me. Oh man, I still have one more to do. Okay. Oh man. What a day to be alive. I'm gonna break both of these so this never happens again. I'm also gonna get snuck up on my spider. Desperation, by the way. Attack him! Attack him! I need money! I need money desperately. Actually, I could probably go downstairs. Whoa! Oh, you cunt. I'm gonna take a pick of this guy. Pick of my mains. No money, of course. I mean, why would he have money? Should I, <laughs> should I gamble? <laughs> how much money do I have? I don't even have enough money to gamble. This is how pathetic this is right now. <laughs> it's so bad. It's okay. We're gonna figure it out. This is a challenge for a reason. But now it's gonna really slow things down. There's, there's some ammo in here. To there's also a camera. Also, camera. There's some money. Was that it? Was that really all there is in here? No. We're gonna check some of the stores for some revenue streams. And I'm absolutely not. There's there's a thing in here that you trigger that unleashes all of these creatures over here, and I'm not dealing with that at all.
They're just they're they are silent spider sl uh, splicers who just roam around in complete silence. You never know when they're behind you, and they deal so much fucking damage. It's insane. Oopsers. Oh, this game, the remastered version, you could run at a solid 60 FPS, no problem. I'm running this at 60 FPS on 4K right now, which never happens on stream, never. But there's other quirks <laughs> in order to uh, still make it weird. So, you know, they remove one issue and they supplement it with another. In true remaster fashion. Alright, so I've got some money now. Let me go take care of this last guy. Then I could, uh... I really wish... He's so low, dude. Damn. Look at that footy. Throw it down for me. I wish I had some hack bots on this side right now. I never wish that. That's how you know video game hard. Okay. She's not dead. Oh, there she goes. There she go. And now I have to deal with him again with fucking telekinesis. I mean, it looks fine to me. I don't have a problem with it. I don't know if it's at if the physics are at 30. I still have to play Soma. I feel like I would really enjoy that. Where the fuck? Where, where's the last one? Where is she? Where's the bench? Do I have to go through here again? Where's the bench? Did it glitch again? <laughs> this fucking game! This game is insane, man. Unless one of them is registered as still alive, because that does happen sometimes. Video game. I think she's up there. The audio log? I don't think- no, I don't think the audio log triggers it. You could try, but... I don't believe so. You just rush through it. There's- there, I think there's three or four spider slicers that are supposed to be. I think I'm trapped in here now. <laughs> oh, this fucking game tonight. might be the end. This might be the end. It's not it's not spawning any more of them. Why? One of these panels is supposed to drop down. Can I like let's see if I had an explosive I'd be able to do something about this, but I don't. Oh, Subnautica freaks me out too. I love that game though, but I I legitimately can't play that game at night because of the fear of open water. Because of the dark, dark water. 
It's very, very freaky. Okay, so I, th I think this might be dead. We don't have- do we have an- oh, the last autosave is in fucking Neptune's bounty. Or the beginning of this level. Oh no. I'm trapped in here forever. They should make a game about rescuing those thigh- uh, those thigh boys. That was a thigh boys. I can imagine. Uh, but it's uh, Elon Musk coming to the rescue with his uh, little submarine. Alright, I think this is dead. I, I don't think we can do this anymore. I think I killed game. I don't feel like doing this all over. Fuck. Shit! Let me, let me just check. Holy shit, it's March 1st. Can you believe that? Yep, it's the beginning of it. You're almost there. The spirits are right, Let me let me, let me see how far I get. I don't think I'm going to I'm going to do this whole game in one sitting now. Royan's handed the keys to Fort Pollock over to a guy named Sander Cole. Quickly. I gotta watch a speedrun of this game and see if there's like some bypasses you could do. You probably just have to be really fucking good. And I think missing wrench jockey really fucked me. <laughs> that would be a sick game. <laughs> I'd, I'd play that 100%. Just a love letter to Elon Musk. Oh, Renshaki is so useful, man. It's all about it. The frozen Field and Wrench Shockey actually work very well Atlas together. Rye. Atlas very Rye. useful. Very da, cool. Da, 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 da. Time was, you could get something decent on the radio. The artist Maybe I should save my antipersonal rounds for uh, and delight the drunkman so say goodbye, who killed me with a projectile know. that he dropped on the and ground. To an evening I wonder if I could like stun lock him or something. Cohen. Like I did before. I don't know what happened to his AI, it just fucking died. No, I haven't seen a sign of real life down here in months. Let's see if you're just another Johnny come lately. Oh. Fall! <laughs> Do I get annoyed with these games? They just, they just ignore actual things that should be happening. No! I, I really need to grab wrench, uh, wrench jockey next time. It's impossible to do otherwise. It's not impossible, but it's really fucking annoying. <laughs> ah! I'll get that I'll take it. What the fuck? I. Wait a second. Oh, maybe I didn't research the, the organs. Never mind. Okay, that's why that happened. Oh my lord. Very cool! Alright, I'm gonna quit it here. I'm just I'm just annoyed that I got locked out of that room. Oh, that's a half an hour of progress just down the tubes, man.
What a what a bullshit way to go. I'm not gonna save this. This is hard. This is a lot harder than I thought it would be. That's all right. Uh, I hope you guys enjoyed this. Uh, it was kind of fun in the beginning, and then it got very hard. Very hard. Very cool. I think it's just because like I'm trying to I'm trying to do this as fast as possible, so I'm just avoiding all ammo. I'm doing like the opposite of what I usually do, but it's a good challenge. It's it's fun to do. I think next time. I gotta, I gotta just watch a speed run and see how people do it. Maybe that'll make it easier. But it's also on the highest difficulty, and I'm also not researching, which I never do. And I'm also, <laughs> I'm also not picking up any atom whatsoever. So this is the absolute nightmare fucking mode. Uh, but I hope you enjoyed. Uh, thank you so much for watching. I'll, I'll be back possibly tomorrow. If not tomorrow, I'll be back by the weekend. Uh, oh, I'll be doing a stream with the two friends on Sunday, so tune in if you like those sorts of things. We'll be playing Jackbox. Uh, it'll be good, okay? Have a good night, everybody. Thank you for watching. Goodbye!